In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the setup of your HP DexJet 4132 printer with the MacBook. Now, first thing is to enter this printer into the setup mode. So, go to the printer control panel. We have to enter this printer into the setup mode. For that, press and hold the wireless button and the cancel button for 3 seconds. 1, 2, 3. Release it. You will see the power light is flashing. After some time, it will stay on and the blue light will start to flash that means our printer is ready for the setup now go to your macbook in the macbook you have to download the hp smart app from the app store open this app in this app we have to add the printer so if you see the plus button on the top right hand side click on it Select HP DexJet 4100 series, click continue, it can access the password of the Wi-Fi automatically, so click continue, press the flashing information button on the printer screen, so that's the information button here, continue the process in your MacBook. Printer is connected to the Wi-Fi, click continue, it's installing the drivers, automatically it will do that. Drivers are installed, so click OK. You should be able to see your printer series, HP DexJet 4100 here. It will display the estimated level of ink and all the icons will show up here. Now we can use it for wireless printing and scanning. In case you don't have Wi-Fi network and you just want to use it for printing and scanning, you can also use a USB data cable. Here the one end will go to the printer and the other will go to your MacBook. So simply install it. The other end goes here. Also switch off the Wi-Fi. Now we don't have Wi-Fi, so I'll show you how to print. So open any document, click on the print icon, select printer series, automatically it should come up here, if not then you can select from this box and click print. So here we can see, if you are using a USB data cable, it works instantly. And if you want uh, Wi-Fi, it depends on the speed of the Wi-Fi, how it works. So this way we can do the setup of this printer with the MacBook using Wi-Fi network and USB data cable. Thanks for watching.